welcome back to the channel your girl Jamada here guys this is the channel where we discuss all things business credit we talk about personal credit we talk about investing and we talk about real estate on this channel guys okay shout out to all my old and new subscribers I love and appreciate you guys so so much for supporting me and supporting the channel if you have not subscribed yet what the hell are you waiting for <laughs> We are a community of entrepreneurs and wealth builders, okay? So join, okay? If you're new and you're just coming up on my videos, subscribe to the channel, okay? Let's feed the YouTube algorithm. I don't know if the like button is over here or if it's over there. I don't know what the hell. Please give this video a like and let's feed the YouTube algorithm. Today, I want us to talk about separating your business finances from your personal finances, guys. Um, when, when you are a new entrepreneur, you're excited and you know, you're ready to take on the world. But if you don't put some things into place properly, okay, if you don't set the foundation right, guys, you're that mansion, that castle you're trying to build is not going to stand and it's not going to last guys. Pretty soon it is going to come crumbling down and on your head it's gonna come crumbling down. So guys, when you're setting up your business, guys, make sure you set it up as a corporation. Let me just put this disclaimer before we go get any further into the topic. I'm not a financial advisor. This is for educational and entertainment purposes, okay? That's what my YouTube channel is for, okay? And I share my experiences with you guys. This is not financial advice by any means. So when you're building your business, guys, structure yourself as, um, structure the business as a core, as a corporation, okay? Because you want to legally separate yourself from the business, okay? Now, I know when you're starting out, some people start out as a sole proprietor. Well, as a sole proprietor, guys, you're using your social security, okay? Everything is on you, Okay? If somebody wants to sue, guess what? They're who they're gonna sue you personally. Okay. Now, if you have a corporation, if the business is standing all by itself, if you run into trouble, the business is the one that's going to take the hit. Okay. The business will get will get sued. Okay. Your personal assets will be protected. That's the good thing about separating yourself from your business, okay? Your business owns everything, but you control it, okay? You're the master over everything, okay? Your business is the one that has the ownership. You're the master of everything. You're controlling everything. So set up as an LLC or some type of corporation, okay? Now, your your as far as your finances are concerned, guys, have your personal bank account, and have your business bank account, okay? Yes, you can deposit money from your personal check-ins into your business check-in, okay? Um, the government is aware that, you know, your new business, you, you, you're you growing your business, so it's okay for you to be able to deposit money from your, your personal check-in to your business check-in. But those transactions, guys, that you're making, your business transactions should stay your business transaction. Your personal transactions should stay your personal transaction. That's why you need a business check-in, a business saving. That's why the business needs its own credit card. And you, as the person, you need your own personal credit card, right? And it's important also, guys, it's one thing to just, you know, sign up with the Secretary of State and get your articles of organization but also, guys, it's important that you pay business taxes as well, okay? I always say this on this channel, guys. We should carry ourselves with integrity, okay? Don't just get this information and run with it and go out there and make poor and just bad decisions, okay? Don't do that. Be a person of integrity, okay? Your, your personal credit should be your personal credit, your business credit, should remain your business credit, okay? The, the two should not mix, okay? And get a good CPA. 
Start paying your business taxes, okay? Every single year, pay your business taxes because you, at the end of the day, you want to be able to scale, okay? If you're making 10000 a month, you want to be able to scale your business to the point where it's making a million dollars a month. You want to get that big. Have that vision for yourself. Okay, I don't want none of this limited thinking and scarce, scarcity mindset. No, start thinking big. So pay your business taxes, okay? Every single year before the deadline, pay it, guys. You are going to reap the benefits, okay? When it comes time to get that $10 million loan that you need because they're gonna wanna see your taxes. So imagine going up to the bank if you've been paying taxes from 2000 up until now, okay? You have a long line of business credit since then. You've been keeping up with your articles of organization, okay? You've been in good standing every year you pay it. Guys, they will give you that money, okay? Obviously, you know what you're doing. You're a person of integrity, okay? The bank will give you whatever you want they will roll out the red carpet for you. And guys, and it's not that expensive to like take care of these things. If, if you're going to be in business, guys, you have business expense, okay? Yes, you will have to pay your taxes and you will have to pay someone to do your business taxes, okay? There will be fees, guys, when it comes to business credit. There are fees you need to pay to keep your business running. If you can't handle that, don't get into entrepreneurship. Don't get into small business, okay? Don't. There are expenses that come with being a business owner and an entrepreneur, okay? So I just wanted to chop it up with you guys um, concerning that, okay? Let's do things with integrity. Let's look at the future, okay? Let's start setting ourselves ourselves up for millions and millions of dollars and it starts now with building the right foundation all right that does it for this video shout out to everyone who have ordered their business credit ebook guys the six figure entrepreneur guide to business credit you can shop the book on my website www.adeholistic.com search ebook okay i'll drop it in the description or in the comment section below i wish you guys all the best on all of your endeavors okay i will catch you on the next video bye